So let's talk tyres. First off, the front tyre, not really so important. Most of the work is going to be done by suspension, but the important stuff is back here. The rear tyre, 19 inch rear tyre. We run tubeless right now, which is really quite interesting. It's only come about in the last a couple of years really, more so this season. All these tyres are distributed at the beginning of the meeting, so the boys don't bring them with them, so they can't doctor the tyres. The compound, the structure of the tyres is the same for everybody. The interesting thing though, if you come around to the back, is that these tyres will only do one race per side. So if you can see here, this side of the tyre has been worn, so this side of the tyre will have done one race. This is a brand new edge. These boys will have spare wheels with them, so they'll have five wheels. That means 10 edges, basically, for the night. The tire will only do one race before it loses traction. The start is so, so important. That's why they want to have a fresh edge. In Speedway, we're constantly turning, so it's always the side of the tire will get worn. The center will get worn a little bit, but not so much. Tire pressure is also something that's really important. I've been talking to the boys, and it will be probably between seven psi up to maybe 12 or 13 psi which is a big difference what that comes down to is rider preference and it's all about a feel most of the stuff with the speedway bike for a rider is more about feel as opposed to statistics because if the tire is softer you'll feel the tire roll more but with it being tubeless you can't run too less pressure because you then be in a situation where the tire may come off the rim which you don't want to do because that's you don't finish the race no points no prizes so for me as well it's all about the feel, the tyre pressures are something that, depending on the traction, if the track goes slicker, they may run a little bit less pressure to enable them to get more traction and win races. So, in Speedway, tyres may not seem quite so important. Obviously, you associate with F1 MotoGP, where it's a fixed surface and the tyres and the compounds become hugely important. In Speedway, it's a forever changing surface, so you may think the tyre is not so important. What is important is the pressure. So, like I said, that's a real personal preference. Tire pressure can make some big gains if you get it right. 